It's over, El Popo. Give up! Never! Patricia, with me. Wait here, Junior. It's over, El Popo. You'll land this hot air balloon and give it back. Never, Warrior Tiger. It's mine. It's two against one. You simply don't stand a chance against us. Right? Ah! Patricia? Ah! Uh, well, it's one against one, and you still don't stand a chance. Huh? Uh, sorry, El Popo. Can we finish this fight later? Okay, it's a ways away. Well, El Popo, we have to move. We must... You broke my hot air balloon, Warrior Tiger! You will pay for this! Have you noticed we crashed on a deserted island? So what? That won't stop me from crushing you. We're in the middle of a fight, remember? Yeah, that is true. Aren't you getting tired, too? Any way we can fight in a somewhat less exhausting manner? Fight in a less exhausting manner? Like what? I don't know. We could play rock, paper, scissors a bit to regain our strength. We have no fingers, so we can only do paper. But we can try. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors! scissors. Paper. paper! You see? Oh, well. Back to fighting? Very well. <laughs> 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 Okay, I'm going to bed. I won't wish you good night, Warrior Tiger. Don't sleep well, El Popo. Hmm. Oh. Maurice! 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 Where are you? Paper scissors. Hmm? Hmm? Yeah! So, Warrior Tiger, shall we finish this? I'd like nothing better. Hmm? Uh, El Popo, could we maybe have a bite first? And then fight? Ah, I thought you'd never ask. Let's do it. So impressive, Warrior Tiger. Here, I'll do it. You will love how I use my head. Well, that was my very first attempt. <laughs> you did that on purpose. You're the one who ran into me, and you say it's my fault? You're the one who ran into me, and you say it's my fault. Don't repeat what I say. Don't repeat what I say. Okay, you want confrontation? <laughs> I won't allow you to... <laughs> Whoa. Yeah! Ooh. You were great, El Popo. Get ready to catch. <sighs> so, El Popo, I was thinking that it might be a good idea to call a truce. It'll give us a chance to build a raft and leave the island. I don't usually make a habit of working with bandits, you understand, but I could make an exception. What do you say? Oh, okay, a truce until we leave the island. But we can't be buddy-buddy. I'm a bandit, you know. I have standards to keep. Perfect. Let's get to it, then. Okay, given what we have here, I think we have enough to make a raft big enough for two. What do you think, El Popo? Hmm? <laughs> Sorry, warrior tiger. I'm a hippopotamus. I don't need your lousy raft. So long! <laughs> okay, but watch out for sharks. Eh? Ah! Uh. Eh... Well, I had to try it, didn't I? Hmm. <laughs> Thanks for the raft, warrior tiger. Don't ever lower your guard. Call me sometime. <sighs> Without a sail, El Popo, you won't get far. Okay, only the sail to repair, and then I can get back to Junior. El Popo, could you help me to... Hmm? 
Seriously? El Popo, in order to leave, we need the raft, the sail, and the mast. Don't you see you're not helping El Popo? The best way to leave this island is to help me get the sail ready for the raft. Meanwhile, I could find some wood to- Look, you're pushing it a bit far, Maurice. I already agreed to stop fighting. I won't stand here and take orders from you as well. I'm a criminal, don't forget that. I don't help the good guys. And actually, your sail is not that well made. You should start over. Huh? Oh. Okay, my sail isn't the best, but it does catch the wind. Still nothing, and it's getting cloudy. We should probably head back now. You might be a crime fighter, but on a desert island, I don't find you particularly effective. Yes, well, we're only here because of you and that hot air balloon. Whew, I'll never understand criminals. Just a minute, warrior tiger. The balloon wasn't for me. It was for my son, my little Kevin. Oh, the balloon was for your son? Yeah, my little Kevin always wanted to fly. I always told him to hang on to his dreams. Yeah. Attempts to make his dream come true have been tried. But honestly, when you're a hippo, it's not easy. Anyway, you have a kid as well, don't you? And what is his dream? Oh, you know, like all kids. He wants to bring peace and justice to the world, fight the bad guys, prevent natural disasters, help everyone in need. You know, that sort of thing. Hmm? Uh-oh. We might have a problem. This time we have no choice, El Popo. Either we finish the raft quickly and get back home, or we wait for the tornado to make us dinner for the sharks. You ready to work with a crime fighter? Can you work with a criminal? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Good. All we have to do is repair the sail and get some wood to fasten it to the raft. You get the sail. I'll get some wood. Some wood, some wood, some wood. Where would I find some... Ah! Bingo! Hmm. Ah! Look, El Popo, here's the first one. The sail is ready. We'll just fasten it to the raft. Great. Start dealing with it, and I'll get the second mast. Um, El Popo, we might have a problem. Aye, aye, aye! Without the second stick, we won't be able to put up the sail! We're done for! I might have a solution. If I reach the second island, I can send you the other half of the trunk and you can escape. What are you talking about? You will sacrifice yourself for me? No way I'm gonna owe anyone, let alone a crime fighter. I prefer we both perish. Ah, uh, how can anyone be so dumb? Okay, you ask for it. Huh? Oh, yeah. No time to lose. It's too late for me. Put up the sail and get out of here. Go find your son. The tornado's coming. Go on, scram. It may not be as bad as all that. On the other hand. I hope you make it so you and little Kevin can fly one day. For me? Wait, he's heading into the storm. Hey now, a flying hippo. Since you saved El Popo by letting him leave with the raft, El Popo had to repay his debt. Junior, we're gonna find him. As soon as Gilbert and Miguel have finished checking out the jungle plane, I promise we'll all go searching together. Uh, just checking. We're even Steven now, right? 
Yeah, I imagine so. I saved your life, you saved mine. Now we can call it quits. <laughs> ah! The juice is over, crime fighter. Next time we're back to fighting. So long, Mr. Maurice. <laughs> Hello, friends. Oh, I missed you so much, Junior. And El Popo? Are we going after him? Uh, you know what? We'll let it slide this time.